There is another very important phase of warfare. It has as its target, not the body, but the mind of the enemy. Bro, how many people are about to go to the list of PSYOPs after this shit? Buy fourth PSYOPs group, and we'll see what the fuck they got. If your opponent is of caloric temper, seek to irritate them. Pretend to be weak, that he may grow arrogant. For those of you who don't know, PSYOP is a lot about like propaganda and like truly manipulating people. Like some of the things we do in CI can be compared to PSYOP, but PSYOP is like truly playing the game of like both sides and like some people will compare it to civil affairs too. But it truly is like with people's heads. And then other things which we can't dive into would be like mill deck. So like military deception and stuff like that. I don't like that. Have you ever wondered who pulls the strings? Miss Keisha does. Miss Keisha. This is like a movie ad, bro. Yo, why the rest of us ain't get promotion like this? Oh. It's the old unit right there, bro. We used to call our patch the ghost booger or like runny noses of a world at war. You'll find us in the shop. Oh my God. I better not see no crazy door breaching shit, bro. Whoa, Saip is going in with some propaganda sh** right now, dude. Russia invades Ukraine. Who's like feeling this right now? It's getting their brain to stir. Uh, uh, Warfare is evolving. Facts. And all the world's a stage. Hey, got him. There is another very important phase of warfare. It has as its target, not the body, but the mind of the enemy. Bro, how many people are about to go to the list of psyops after this shit? Anything we touch is a weapon. That is so true. Anything is a weapon. And their biggest one will say the biggest weapon is the pen. Because you can write shit down and then you allow people to see it. But if you're not around and the people aren't around, how do they know who wrote it? But then you can truly start to warp the mind because people can think whatever the fuck they want. Because you can always say like, that person wrote that and it can be the winning side that you want it to be and you can truly start to manipulate the mind, therefore manipulate the people, therefore manipulate the funding, therefore manipulate the war. Influence the thoughts of the enemy soldiers. And at the same time, is expected and encouraged to study foreign Sweet. languages and the social science and a broad and sympathetic understanding of all faces Inspire. of human experience. You can do all those things with propaganda, right? And manipulating that mind. We come in many forms. But the use of this force as an integral part of combat has now taken... We come in the form of a clown, bitch. We are ever... They're kind of giving me this anonymous vibe, you know? <laughs> Wow. Hey, the ghosty. Okay, stop. They sigh out not breaching doors and shit. It is a game of chess for sure. The money, the flyers. Ghost. For those of you who don't know this image, actually, let me let me go back. So right here, you'll see them flipping this tank, right? I don't know if this is mill deck exactly, but there was an overwhelming force of like tanks and shit, right? And they had satellite imagery. And then I forget what the two components were, but they were like, oh, they're coming. And they know we don't have a lot of firepower, a lot of numbers on our side. So they put these decoy tanks out there, right? They put hundreds of decoy tanks out in this field. And then they allowed when the air was coming over for ISR, uh, which are like the planes you take photos, intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance is what ISR stands for. And they're like, oh my God, they have like a hundred tanks there now. We can't go and fight them. But all they were was blow up tanks. They weren't real. But that caused the entire enemy forces to divert and go another way, which bought them time and saved a bunch of lives. And it's like, whoo, bro. That shit, it, it's very deceiving. What are you? Psy war? Oh, that's gay, bro. Oh, this was a. We are psy war. No, bitch. We are psyops. Psychological operation. That would have been cool. For those of you who don't know, psyops is special operations. Okay. These are the psy war soldiers. Verbum vince. Uh, it's like the the word will conquer. Okay, there we go. Goarmysoft.com. If you go to the soft special operations website, you'll have like all this shit. It'll be like explosive ordnance disposal, 75th range regiment, 160th SOAR, civil affairs, psychological operations, which is the video we just saw, psyops, and then special forces, unconventional minds for unconventional warfare. Psyop operators are adaptive thinkers who specialize in unconventional capabilities, cultural expertise, language proficiency, military deception, cyber warfare, and advanced communications techniques across all platforms of media. 
PSYOP soldiers operate in small autonomous teams or with other special operations forces to persuade and influence local populations in support of U.S. military objectives. Discover the psychological operations legacy. Like we talked about, their whole job is to come in and be like, oh, everyone's going to freak out right now. Oh, we're going to help you. And then what they do is they take the things that you need, they know what scares you, and they slowly start to twist and manipulate it to go with the military objective that we need accomplished. Mission always comes first. Um, increased family time. That's a lie. Station, longevity, and stability. Eh. Foreign language proficiency. No, gay. Uh, unique mission and variety and arrangement. No, stupid. 30 day vacation per year. Eh. Complete medical and dental care. You're in the f military. You're going to get that anyways. Enhanced leadership skills. Yep, all those are. <laughs> Stupid, stupid, stupid. No more than 10 years combined active federal service if prior service. GT score of 100. Why is it so low? Pass a physical fitness test. D-Lab score of 75. Willing to volunteer for airborne training. Five-year enlistment contract. Must be a U.S. citizen. Oh, they just recently updated this shit. Must be a U.S. citizen and eligible to possess a secret security clearance. You're going to need a TS. Must meet all qualifications of initial entry in 31 Bravo. What? Well, there you go. And then, like I said, if you guys want to go to the website, goarmysoft.com. You can go here and you can actually see all of this shit. That's pretty much it. Oh, wait, here we can watch this little video, too. Psychological operations. It's like nothing. Like the video we just saw. Oh, there we go. Now they did a little bit of shooty and a little bit of money. What a terrible f***ing ad. Jesus Christ. Are you kidding me? By the way, guys, don't get it twisted. That ad was cool and all. The one we saw before this, not this one. Psyops isn't fully what it's kicked out to be. I know a lot of PSYOPs dudes who hate it. They're trying to go do other things. I know a lot of PSYOPs dudes actually went to civil affairs and I already think civil affairs doesn't do a whole lot of shit. They're kind of like same, same, but different, but still same. For those of you who don't know, civil affairs is this one. If that got you guys like hyped up, let me know down below in the comments because I'm curious uh, if anybody's like, I want to be PSYOPs now. We need more PSYOPs shit. And I'll be like, okay. I'll pull up some PSYOP shit or I'll get someone to come and talk to psychological operations and stuff like that. Someone really needs to let Nico take control of the ads for the military. Yo, PSYOPs. Sign me up, bro. I do it. And then I'll pop up. I'll be like, we lying to you. Or I'll be like, yo, this is the truth. Come sign up, please do. We need we need people. But war is changing, and I'm surprised they put that ad out right now. With everything going on in Russia and Ukraine. That kind of makes me nervous. I'm like, oh shit, what the f is going on now? Why'd they do that shit? But uh that's it. Thanks for stopping by.